What's up, YouTube world? It's KGB here from the KGB Adjuster Show. Uh, today we were gonna we're gonna do something a little bit crazy. As you can see, I've got a lot of different things in front of me. Uh, we're going to take apart a lamp, and I'm going to retrofit it so that this shaft here is actually this gun. I'm gonna spray paint like I just want to get one of the paint pieces painted because it's just a quick primer coat of black you put on there. Let it dry for an eh, hour, maybe two, just depending on it. And it's, it's actually kind of chilly out here today, so sorry, I got a little piece here. Uh, it's a little chilly today, um, so it'll probably take about two hours for it to fully dry. Uh, I'm going to try to make sure that it doesn't bubble up too much. Um, but yeah, what we're going to do is we're basically, we're going to take this gun, we're going to spray paint it to where it looks almost real ish <laughs> and then we're gonna make a lamp out of it uh, and I'm gonna kind of go with the steps and processes now when you go buy a lamp like if you buy a new modern one they're a pain in the ass to actually get done done right uh, so be warned if you can find an older lamp it's probably gonna be a lot easier to take apart disassemble the head and everything so that you can actually do what I'm doing um, but as for right now this is what we're gonna be starting with it's uh, Started out as just a toy gun, green, orange, it's looking ugly. Uh, once I get it fully spray painted, I'll put the trigger mechanism back in. Taste. Basically, this one came with a ton of little tiny bolts, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18 little tiny screws. Thanks, Hasbro. <laughs> Uh, but once you get the screws apart, you want to take the gun apart, take the, uh, the mechanism, the firing mechanism out, uh, spray paint it, get it dried, get it put back together, and then you'll drill, you'll drill your bottom and your top holes. Um, basically what you're doing when you're drilling your bottom and your top holes is your top hole, you're going to be basically running your cord through, out, out whatever end that you, can, you want it out of, um, uh, and, and then into the base, which we will keep the actual base to the lamp. Uh, once the lamp is actually done, um, we should be able to either, I'm going to try to figure out a neat way to actually pin it up where I'm either using the, the trigger to ignite it, basically turning the light on, or I'll, I'll fashion something. But as for right now, we're going to cut it here. Alright, and we've got a little bit more to finish. It's a damn hard thing to do by yourself. Jester is in for a bitch when he gets out of work tonight. But basically, if you like take a step back, that's basically going to be the gun. You have your lampshade will cover up almost to about right about here. Got to get a small lampshade for it. And I got some nades to paint over there. Uh, get those painted up and put on the base there. Cover up my rig up job there. Uh, but uh, this is mm, this is what part two looks like. Next, we're going to have to get the connection piece here. We're going to have to get a solid port for that, which I'm probably going to have to jerry-rig something up pretty good for that because it's got to be pretty sturdy. So we'll see what we come up with next. Lay it down or keep it even. There you go. Now, this, I think, is going to be a surprise. Uh, my nephew is joining the army, um, and uh, he's actually going off to boot camp in a, a couple of days. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you have any comments or if you need to know how to do anything, feel free to let me know. Uh, this is KGB. Y'all have a good one.